You can make an awesome video, but if your title isn't crafted right, you'll never get it seen. So in this video, I'm gonna help you write titles that get found and clicked on. Let's go. Okay, so if you watched the last video and took action, you should have discovered some topics for your videos. And you may have spotted on the worksheet that step seven went on to titles, so let's pick up there. Our hopes for getting ranked and ideally seen on the first page of Google is totally dependent on Google thinking your content is the best solution for their customers. So if your title is exactly what someone types into the Google search bar, that's your first step to being considered by Google. Then they look at what previous viewers of your videos thought. How long did they stay? Did they leave you a comment? Did they give you a thumbs up or subscribe? This is all Google has to work with and it's really clever at finding the best results for its customers. That's why we love it, right? So your video content has to be good too, else the titles are irrelevant. Can you see how it all fits together? These are individual stages that all need to be done right, which is why I've put this whole playlist together for you. So what is your customer typing into Google? Try to put yourself in their shoes. Google is great at auto-filling the search and helping you get more specific search phrases. If I'm trying to teach people how to make videos with their camera, I only have to start typing in how to make V and it fills in several common searches and I'm likely to choose one of those suggestions. So start making a list. What is Google suggesting or what is YouTube suggesting as they're based on the same algorithms, I'm sure. So write your titles with the search phrase at the start of it. Then you wanna either end it with a benefit or a number. For example, this video was called Titles for your YouTube videos that get ranked and clicked. I know they are benefits that people want. Alternatively, people love numbers in sales copy. And what I've realized is that if someone is working through a number of stages, I'm way more likely to watch the whole video because I wanna see what those last few stages are. My previous video was called Coming up with content for your YouTube videos in six steps or you can use numbers as a time. For example, become a YouTube expert in 24 hours. I recommend you study what the big players in your niche are doing. They're likely to be well-trained in finding titles as they understand the value of them. So why not learn from them? Keep your eyes and your mind open while you're doing this too, because I guarantee you'll get loads of ideas for future videos. So start with what your audience is looking for, try different searches, play around with it, Take that phrase, put it at the start of your title, then add a benefit to it that will get their interest and get them to click on your video. And remember to mention the keyword phrase several times in the video itself and the description. But we're gonna cover that in a future video. Now you have your title sorted, we'll look in the next video at structuring and scripting your videos. Okay, the link should be here, so I'll be waiting over there for you whenever you're ready.